Today, I want to go over our takeoff product and some of the tips and tricks I typically use to make efficient use of the product. When you come into Plan Hub, you'll see that there's a takeoff CTA right here in your global nav. When you click on this, you will come to the takeoff page where you will see a list of all the projects that you have initiated a takeoff on. Here, you can actually, let's say, for example, I'm going to go to site work. You can go in that project and see the files that you have been working on. Click go back. You go see all the projects that you have. If you have a lot of projects and there's more than shows on this particular screen, you can paginate and go back and forth to see all your projects. Now, I'm going to go into this particular project, so I'm going to click the Launch Takeoff CTA. This will bring us into our project. Here, you will see two tabs, site, the name of your project, Site Work, and then over here, Project Measurements. Any measurement that you take on this project, you will see it here. And this table is scrollable, and I'll demonstrate how. Next, you have your toolbars here. When you're first in the project, you can't use this toolbar because you'll land on the very first file. But if I go into a page, let's say, for example, this particular page with a site work on it, you see the toolbar becomes active. I can use it. Now, on this pane over here, you'll see all the files and pages within the file that you'll do takeoffs on. On the right hand side over here, you see your measurements and a library of measurements that you saved that you want to use over and over again. Additionally, if we were to zoom in and you needed more real estate, you can use these little CTAs there to collapse the side panels so you can actually get more working space on your project. All right, fantastic. So I'll see you in the next video where we'll go through some of the tools. Mm -hmm.